What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to talk about one trick that's super easy to learn and will definitely spice up your next session. Let's go. One, three, five, go! Coming from the wild, wild west indeed. Okay guys, so the topic we're going to talk about today is grabs. Grabs are actually super easy to learn, but a lot of times people don't think about them until they get super good, they can do a bunch of tricks and they're like, oh, maybe I should start adding some grabs. So today we're going to talk about five pretty easy grabs to learn, which will definitely help you have a lot more fun on your next session. Let's go. Okay, so the first grab we're going to talk about is a nose grab. And basically, just popping off the water, going to be using your front hand to grab the front of the board. And here I'm doing a tail grab and basically use my back hand to grab the back of my board. Okay guys, and with grabs, there's only a few things you need to really pay attention to. One, you want to make sure you're really good at loading and popping, whether that be using just your board or using your kite to send the jump. You just want to make sure you're getting up in the air with enough time to lock on a grab. And then, when you're going for the grab, you want to make sure you kind of bring your knees and your board up. So you're kind of making your body small in a sense, and then you can lock on a grab. That's much more efficient than trying to like reach down and touch your toes. So yeah, just make your body small, knees up, boards right there, and you can lock on whatever grab you want to do. And next up we have a stale fish grab, which is actually one of my favorite grabs to do. Then we have an indie grab, grabbing the toe side center of our board. And then we have a melon grab, which is using our front hand to grab the heel side center of our board. And once you get these dials, you can just start, you know, combining them with tricks that you already know. Here I'm doing a still fish front roll, little double grab, tail grab to still fish. And here I'm adding a nose grab to a little front roll transition. So as you can see, grabs can be applied to lots of different tricks. And they're super fun because once you learn them, you're going to take them with you on pretty much every session. So go, let's grab and yeah, spice up your next session. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. Hopefully yeah. <laughs> it's too much going on. <laughs> Outro bloopers, we need some more. <laughs> okay guys, that's it for today's video. Hopefully it helps you have a lot more fun on your next session. If it did, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, share with a friend. And also, if you really enjoyed this video, please go and check out my Patreon page. It gives you guys the option to kind of donate a small amount and help me make more trick tip videos. So yeah, that's it guys. Peace, love, happy shredding. I'll see you guys soon. Big up. <laughs>